hello students welcome back to my youtube channel so till the last video we have learned about various tags and inserting images and putting image in the background so today we'll learn about list table and hyperlinks so let's start so first of all list so lists make your web page more readable and attractive okay so there are mainly two types of lists ordered and unordered ordered list means which are numbered unordered lists are not numbered they are bulleted okay so let's see how to put lists in web page using html coding okay to uh, put the unordered list you have to write ul that is unordered list and list the names let's say coffee close the this is the first element of the list let's copy this thing and I have to close the ul tag Okay. in this way unordered list will be created unordered list will be bulleted not numbered so let's change the elements name ist so for putting ordered list I have to write ol then same thing And close the OL tag. Okay, I should put a line here font color equal to red list top four. So I hope it is clear to you. So let's just check this code. Control S, first HTML. See, list of items. This is the unordered list. This is the ordered list. Unordered lists has come with bullets, and they have come with numbers. Okay. Now let us learn how to uh, prepare tables in HTML pages. Okay. To prepare table, we should use three tags table tag tr tag and td tag table is used to initiate the table tr means table row okay and td means table data you see i will start with table tag then tr okay tr will initiate the table row okay first row then in the first row the data's the data will be uh, like coffee td then copy it okay So table tag started, the row started and they are the data of this row. Okay, it means three data, that means it has the table has three columns. Okay, you don't have to specify the column. Okay, you just have to specify the row. Okay, so there is nothing like TC table column, there is nothing like that. There is only table row. So first row is done so now we'll insert another row of copying let us put some other data 
print butter jam okay now at last I have to close the table tag okay now control s let's just check it now see it is a table okay but it doesn't look like a table because there are no borders okay so to put the borders to put the borders we have to use one attribute in the table tag border equal to let's say 4 okay now it is looking like a table okay now see there is one mistake I have not closed it properly so here it is coming in like this so I should close it properly now I think the table will come nicely see it is looking like a nice table okay now we'll study about links so what are links hyperlinks hyperlinks are the links in a web page which on clicking takes you to another web page okay or another location so to create hyperlinks we use a tag called anchor tag it is written like a okay and a href attribute okay now we have to give here the location within quotes so location may be any picture any file on your computer or any other web pages okay so first of all let me try with the picture in my computer so let me copy this thing now there is a picture called keyboard 850 in my desktop so I'm copying that thing only okay now like this I have to close this angular bracket now I have to write something here it will appear on the web page and I have to click on this line only which I am writing here now click to see the keyboard now I have to close the anchor tag control s then see here is a link click to see the keyboard if I click here then a keyboard is displayed okay so this is how I linked a picture to my web page now we can also link a link another web page to this web page the process is same just have to uh, let me copy this thing the process is same just have to keep the name of the web page here okay here okay now let me create okay I have created a HTML page here so tier data let's say Ferrat Coley
another I'm, I'm just creating a table here so another the table okay let's just see close the table and and and, and, and the HTML also okay so this is a new HTML file I have created so I have to save is new page HTML. So let's just check it. It is correct or not? New HTML. Where is new HTML? New page. So see, the background picture has come, and there is a table also. Okay. Can you see? There is a table also. So in my previous HTML page, this I will link this. I will link this new page HTML into this first HTML okay here I will link new page dot HTML okay see I am not giving any location here see users means any drive location here because I know these both the HTML codes are in the same folder in the same folder this in this folder is first HTML and new page if your both codes are in the same folder then you can give only the name of the file but if they are in different folders then you have to specify the file location okay now control s and this is my this is my first HTML see here is a link go to the next page if I click here I am redirecting to another page new page.html this is how I can go to another page from one page okay these are all the web pages are created actually an a an website is a collection of many web pages and this is how uh, a linking is done okay so I hope it is clear to you so your chapter 5 is finished so you are done with your HTML and if you have any doubts regarding this HTML topic you can ask me and we'll meet sometime later till then take care thank you